Greg Wallace has shared his take on a sweet and sour chicken recipe which he says is not only incredibly delicious but also boasts being super healthy. The Master Chef presenter has been open about his weight loss journey after losing 5 stone. The 59-year-old tipped the scale at 17 stone, he cut out junk food from his diet after doctors warned him to lose weight. Greg regularly shares the secrets behind his weight loss on social media, and he recently posted a healthy Chinese fake-away recipe that he says beats a takeaway dish on so many levels. After challenging his wife on TikTok to see if he could whip up a fake away faster than it takes her to order one and pick it up, the cook whipped up a healthy sweet and sour chicken. To celebrate this, I am sharing my sweet and sour chicken recipe for you all to enjoy yourselves rather than spending money on a takeaway this weekend. To celebrate this, I am sharing my sweet and sour chicken recipe for you all to enjoy yourselves rather than spending money on a takeaway this weekend. In a helpful tip during the video, the chef said that you should always cut peppers and chilies on the blunt side of the vegetable to stop the knife from slipping. The recipe, which serves too, is quick and easy. You can read how to make it below. Join the Daily Records WhatsApp community here and get the latest news sent straight to your messages. Greg Wallace's Sweet and Sour Chicken Recipe Ingredients 100 grams chopped pineapple 1 tablespoon soy sauce 1 teaspoon grated ginger 1 tablespoon olive oil 230 milliliters pineapple juice 400 grams chicken, diced 1 teaspoon garlic granules 1 tablespoon honey 2 peppers, chopped 400 grams passata 3 spring onions, chopped 250 grams cooked brown rice method prepare your ingredients and put your rice on to cook add olive oil to pan and letting it heat before adding the chicken, cook until white all over once the chicken is cooked, add ginger, garlic granules, spring onion and pepper to pan, stir and cook for about 5 minutes add basada, soy sauce, honey and pineapple juice to pan, stir and let thicken once the sauce is thick enough for you, add your pineapple chunks, if it isn't thick enough you can add some corn flour, enjoy. Don't miss the latest news from around Scotland and beyond. Sign up to our daily newsletter.